Hello all you wonderful little whelplings. It's time for some more mercenary monsoon because I keep failing. I got further last time though. Um, Wait, if there's one thing we learnt, it's that it's always the way that you don't think it is. So let's go this way. Yeah, like we got to level 3 this time. You know, so it's close. Sort of. Um, hey, found it. Nice. See? It's always the other way. Don't know what that's about. Some kind of weird programming. Like Maybe like you go one way and it spawns it the other. Ooh. Let's go again. See? No problem. Yeah, um, we pretty much got bombarded by some sort of mechanical spiderling. Well, I say spiderling, it was about about ten of them, maybe? Just barraged. Completely and utterly barraged. I've already got a nice uh, double damage item here. Chance to deal double damage, double, double damage, which is cool. We do like a bit of double damage. Anyone who says otherwise is a filthy liar. I don't know why I love the music in this game so much. Is it just because it reminds me of old action films? It's just awesome. Yeah. It's jellyfish don't stand a trance. Hmm, well, this guy's nearly down already. Not really much of a problem. Sweet, and we have uh, a lifesteal item, which is always nice. Any items up here? I can't remember, nope. Let's start roaming around. We've got a little time left, but... I suppose actually we should probably start murdering things. Quite a few Ooh, cooldowns. Yeah, we are a bit of a cluster of enemies. Check them down quite quickly. See, there's only 14 left. See, we're racing through. We could probably we even get there before the buzzer. This is going to be like some kind of speed run. Ooh. Not many left. Are they all over here? One, two, three, four, yes. Screw it. We're keeping our money and we're gonna jump ship. I reckon. Let me what all you reckon. Yeah. Level two look, we're not even I suppose we're in just in the easy pit. Starts off very easy, I think, then it goes easy. Sky Meadow, oh I much prefer this one to the fungal fungal cavity cave. Oh, I'm forgetting my own rule. It's always the other way. Oh well. Maybe we can disprove this rule. Nope, nope. It's it's the other way. Oh, god damn it! Unless it's up there. I'm pretty sure you can't climb that one. There we go. See, experience. The voice of experience. <laughs> Look at them shafts of light fading in and out of existence. Gorgeous. Gorgeous bit of pixelation. What do you reckon these are? Tell me. Tell me what they are. They're like light bulbs, but they're not. There's so many things in. That's one thing you can always say about pixel art, I suppose, is that it gives you just enough information to make up your own mind about what things are a lot of the time. It's like those old. Uh, Old Nez, Snez games, arcade games, whatever, where they just sort of didn't have enough graphic capabilities to have a resolution that could depict enemies very well. So you'd have, oh, this is the the uh, the, the hamburger wave sign character, yes, or whatever. Oh, exit, sweet. We're cracking on today. Magma worm. I like this guy actually. Now, last time you jellyfishes murdered me on this level. 
So I'm going to have to try and keep your numbers down. I haven't got very much money. Oop. There we are, we keep got rid of all the jellyfish nearly so far, which is good. I'm genuinely terrified of having more than like maybe four of them <laughs> based on that other run. Oh, that sounded good. Was that like a double damage attack? Because it was, it was louder, wasn't it? I guess when you do double damage, it's just like louder. That's cool. Sweet. Let's start on these. There's quite a few. I think we'll. Oh. Okay, so I took quite a lot of full damage, coupled with their damage. It was not good. All right, I'm out of here. It's too much damage in one place. Oh god. <laughs> oh god. This is this is quite scary. Uh, but fortunately, we can utilize the environment. Yes. See that one's too bad. Nice bit of damage. Oh, I ate a bit there. It's, it's all about deciding the order of your attacks, I guess, with the mercenary. Oh my god, there's bajillions of them. They're still spawning. Oh, oh god. Fuck. Not the jellyfish thing all over again. No cooldowns, no cooldowns, no cooldowns. Oh. I can at least get rid of a jellyfish. Oh, at least we're down to just the amount of enemies left. So there needs to be another way to get out of there. Oh shit, there's too many. I'm gonna so just die when I get there. Use the brief respite where there's no jellyfish. Here they come. Ouch. Lure the jellyfish away again. That loud worm didn't even touch me. There we are, completely avoiding damage by using two to land. Nearly got all these guys. Ow! Really, I shouldn't be getting hit by them. Quite a slow, predictable attack. I think if you've been hit by that, you're probably bad. But hey, I'm out of practice. Hey, hey! Right, let's, let's just kill this worm. Get his fat loot. Come here, you bugger. Sorted. Right, now we get a chance to freeze enemy on hit. That's cool. Sweet. Very nice. Very nice. Right, this is terrifying. <laughs> Ooh, somehow I avoided that. See, it's all about timing when there's that many. Missile drone? Oh, look at this. Can I just... Can I just chill here? <laughs> I've got to do something, but I think if I go down there, right, I'm just going to get chonked. I'm doing quite a lot of damage, actually. I think I'll probably be all right. Oh, that was loud. Oh god, <laughs> the sound just stacks in volume. Oh my god, there's loads of them. I didn't see all them. They must have been hiding inside the other characters. Oh, they're quite fragile, those enemies, I suppose. That's the one upside. Uh, to be fair, it's probably my missile drone doing the majority of the work. Uh, there's one enemy left. Oh, is that one on the ledge, wasn't it? Well, let's quickly nip to the exit. I know, I should be buying things, but... It just takes time. What do you guys reckon? Tell me, right? Do you think I should go for 
saving time like I have been, or scavenging all my money and spending it all on, on stuff. I'm just paranoid of getting to like, oh, I hate this level so bad. <laughs> Why can't I have a different one like Lava Weld or, or something? Sludge men? I forget what they're called. Oh yeah, I'm supposed to be looking to exit. Ooh. I'm liking this missile drone. I think he's probably going to be my saving grace. Because while I'm just caking my pants and fleeing, he's going to be taking them to brown town, as it were. Yes. Oi, free cash. I think I should try to kill at least one thing, just so that I can open a chest or something. See, there's already these spawn now. Oh god. That freezing thing is awesome. I freeze them in place, my missile drone nukes them in the face. See, chests are like 285. I've got nothing from that bull. So I'm gonna have to kill maybe five things. How much is in there? Not a lot. Barely 10. Oh, the exit. Oh, cool. I'm getting pretty lucky. So oh god. <laughs> I was about to say I'm getting pretty lucky, but honestly, I've only ever fought this Ifrit um, a couple of times. I'm not sure of all the intricacies of his fight, but I'm pretty sure he just yeah he punches the floor and fire comes out of it, um, and he summons pillars to block you off, so that you're trapped in with him, which isn't too bad. The main problem, I think, is him trapping you in with the, in the minions. Them minions can hurt large. So I'm just going to try and get as close as I can to this ladder so that if he traps me I can escape. Oh. Oh god. There's so many. I was tempted to use that, but... Quick! Yes! Now I can go down here. Oh, my missile drone can get him. What's this? Oh, poison trap at low health. That's quite cool. I I once had a run on... I wasn't on Monsoon. It was on, I think, Normal or something. Where I got so many, like, on low health items. But I just could not die. Things would get me to low health and my items would just murder everything. So good. Except that there was one point where I wanted to die, but I can't remember what that's for. Some unlock, I'm sure. There's a lot of that shit going on. I think that's what killed me last time, wasn't it? All those missiles. Uh, spread them out a bit. I think if you keep moving, it, it sort of spreads the enemies around, so that's cool. <laughs> they follow you. They, like, jump off the edge. The little men. Oh my god, my face. I'm escaping. Oh god. Alright, when the rem remaining enemies portion of the of this show. I do have that lifesteal. So if I can fight them just a few at a time. And maybe freeze them while I lifesteal. I might be able to make my health go up while I fight. But I'm fairly convinced that I'm not going to get that much healing from my from my life skill relative to the amount of damage I do, or the damage that they do to me rather. I've only got one stack of it. I'm doing alright so far. We can get this too. Nice. Now I can launch missiles on use. So is this run going to turn me into some kind of missile mercenary monsoon mode? Hmm. I reckon. Let's try this again. Oh, that's like double damage and attack speed. I think I'd rather have my missiles. Let's play safe. I think a lot of the unused damage items do scale, but not... Oh my god! Oh, as if you summoned that down here. That's not very fair. I'm ducking. <laughs> Well, that was fun. Uh, 
two, one, and we have missiles. Okay, that wasn't too good actually. Well, I mean, I'm getting some of the health down. Ooh. Honestly, this pack is much more terrifying to me than the lot up there. Because of these spider barrages, and that's been more or less dealt with, so... I can pretty much chill out now, I think. I didn't know if it could summon uh, walls downstairs and stuff, though. That's, that's interesting. What's in there? Nothing. Great. Can't even afford the next one. Watch my size. Fuzzy me dead. Okay. Right. I really just don't like those. <laughs> it's not this. Just so bad. Um, okay. Let's see what breaks loose here. See if we can get past level three. See how well I do dens to be about how quickly I get through the stages. I mean, wait till my three skills available. Use a three, three, two, and a three. That seems to work well. Missiles. Ooh. Oh, three's not available. Oh, my face. Yes. If it's down. So now I'm not going to get blocked off, which is cool. There's not that many left. I get the Ifrit thing. Uh, I can't remember what that does exactly. But usually the boss things give you boss-like abilities. I like the um, the Wandering Vagrants one. It's cool. It's like the missiles that I have, but I think they're a bit better. I'm not sure, though. Might be on par. You'd think they'd be better, though, wouldn't you? Um, retaliation on taking heavy damage. Another one of those you can't kill me buttons. It's a very interesting way how they deal with the survivability is uh, on taking heavy damage, things die rather than you take less damage. Chance to fire a flaming wave. It's quite cool. Oh, this I love. Drones are equipped with explosive weaponry. See, my uh, my dude, he's got little things on the side. Oh, he's going to be a star of the show. Just does like splash damage, basically. If you are familiar with the term, damage around the initial damage location. <laughs> like how those um, clay men, I think they're called clay men, do like little ninja rolls. It's cool. Where was the exit? Was it? Oh, it was over here. It tells me. Yay! I've got quite a lot of cash. The cool is already up to insane. I've got another drone. We'll just grab everything on the way. Chance to evade attack. That's quite cool. Not very reliable. But it's always nice when it procs. Especially when you get lots of stacks of it and it procs fairly lots. Alright, we managed to get onto level 4. Lava level. I think after this one we go to the level before the boss level, which is cool. If I remember correctly, there's like four and four stages randomly ish generated and then the, there's like a selection of stages per each stage and then there's um the fifth stage you can choose to go to the temple the ancient ground temples whatever or you can just keep going through these stages to get more and more items if you don't think you're equipped enough for the temple level um and then you go to like the, the spaceship at the end so that's the format so you can get an idea of how close we've gone to it, I should probably start looking for the exit. I've never seen this exit over here actually, so I'm not sure why I'm going here, but it might be. It might surprise me. In fact, it might have been where I spawned, because it's sometimes down there, but you think the game wouldn't put it where I spawn. That'd just be... That'd be silly, wouldn't it? Wouldn't it? I don't think doing that actually increases my move speed, to be honest with you. Because there's like a delay after you do it. There it is. I think it's actually one, yeah, the Kermator. 
He's always seems to be the boss in this level. I think it's like a stage specific boss that you always get. Could be wrong, but actually, yeah, I think I am wrong because I've seen, I've seen that um, brood mother one, whatever it is, the the pig mother thing, spawn on here before. Oh my god, that noise! Oh. Basically, avoid that barrage of shit that he splings at you, and you'll be fine. Oh god. To be honest, right? I seem to be surviving quite well. And is it just me or did they all get frozen at once? <laughs> is it because the attack got frozen with an AoE? That's cool. <laughs> Do it again. I love that. That's so awesome. I want like a bajillion stacks of this frozen thing. That's cool. Just to go and freeze them. Are they all just going to spawn on here? And I'll just repeat this motion. What's that? That's quite painful, I'm moving. <laughs> Whatever that was. Now... Going back the same way is not generally a good idea in this game. I would like that, please. I'm moving. Ooh, time that just right, isn't it? That exclamation mark means one of my drones is close to uh, exploding and taking damage. We are being very much chased. But it's okay, because apparently we've got fairly decent damage distribution. I wonder if maybe some of that's due to the the Ifrit item. Although, actually, I reckon it's arms race. Looks like the uh, looks like the drones are doing quite a lot of heavy hitting. Yes, all your attacks explode. Mm, yeah, well, that's forty-one more enemies. There's an orange one, so it probably does a lot of damage. Or his orange run speed. It looks like he used to be like ridiculous. Why is that red? Is that that fire coming out of me? Right? Is that the Ifrit thing? Or is that my drone? Oh, and everything dies. <laughs> uh. Hmm. I'll tell you what. Oh. If this is the thing, yay, mortars. We like a bit of mortars, don't we, lads? Yes, yes, we do. Right, home stretch. Everything explodes. Everything. My attacks explode. What did I get? What? Hatch a strange creature who drops buffs periodically. I think that buff is basically run speed. If I recall correctly. Oh, come on now. Well, we're getting there. Although the final teleporter looked like a regular teleporter, it didn't look like a um, ancient temple -y teleport. So maybe I have to do an extra stage in Monster. Oh my god, it's hard to even see what's going on. Basically, AoEs are going on. Everything's up there now. Let's kill this guy, he's irritating me. In fact, actually, I don't know why I jumped down here, I'm not entirely sure how to kill him. Is it wise to be down here with him? <laughs> it's fine. Take much damage, that's cool. Hmm. Uh, it's going to take ages. I'm going to lose too much time. What if I follow him? Then I'm going to die in the lava though, aren't I? Follow him. Hmm, 
Come back, you coward. Fight me like a... Like a piece of shielded artillery. Oh my god, my face is actually dying quite a lot. So I'm going to get out of here. I'll come back for you. You giant pain in the butt, holy oh. Alright. Let's kill your little henchies first. Probably with a life stall and a bit of my health back by then. Ooh, another... Another robot. Are they flamethrower robots? Is that where all the flames come from? Yeah, it is. I, was, I thought it was the Ifra power. Like, Jesus, this power's good, but no. <laughs> Not at all. Sorted. Sorted. If in doubt, use drones, apparently. Alright, they fell down here, which is annoying. Um... Oh, that's right, that's not too bad. That just leaves the cremator. Right. <laughs> nice. Come back, you coward. I don't think I can really... Make my drones avoid that, to be honest with you. A couple more passes and he's down. Oh, missed him. Oop. Come on, sunshine. Sorted. Knock back. All that for some boxing gloves. Look at that, look. Explosive blasts around my my jumpy slash. I'll tell you what, if not for this green arrow, I'd have to find the exit all over again every time. I'm terrible. Um just wanna point something out. That <laughs> difficulty is ha 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 on monsoon mode. So I really don't have that many buffs considering. Well, we'll see. We'll see. Oh, it automatically took me to the temple. Oh, no, that's right, yeah, the fifth one is the temple all the time. Um, and then you can either go to the starship or go to revisited levels, and I think every level after that you can choose to go to the starship. Yeah. Blighty Clayman boss has already spawned. I think I accidentally hit the button to restart my PC. I thought I'd turn off those um, updates. Well, if it all makes it restarts and just like kills everything, then there you are. I'll tell you what, these drones, I'm doing like nothing. <laughs> these drones are doing everything. Is the exit down here? No. On we go. There it is. Alright, what boss do we get? What was that? Oh, it, it must be that. So you can farm this boss, because once you get the boss's only thing left, you can just farm these little... these little sp off spawn. What it does is it, it spawns the... bloody house loud. It spawns these little... Spawn these little pigs near you. Um, I'm taking heavy damage. Oh god, there's the boss. I'm gonna leave him for the time being. Oh my god, there's so much. I think my only chance is to run. And then when everything is spawned to just pick it off. I know that's boring, but... But hey. It's good that the game makes it difficult. Let's have a 
fucking... What do we get? Oh, yes. I love this light. Light clay man. We could do with killing him. He's quite powerful, actually. And he's following us around like an annoying little... Little... Little flange matange. Oh my god, no! No, don't die, don't die. Oh, Somehow lived. <laughs> like 2k gold. Let's try and lifesteal. I wonder if I get lifesteal for my drones attacks. Mind you, if I did that, I'd probably just be constantly alive. Oh no! Tell you what, this is probably my best run on monsoon with a mercenary. I'm just saying something, because I'm not sure. I, know, I might have gotten to the starship before, but I don't think so. Not with a mercenary. Well, since the difficulty is already on max, we can actually afford this time to go around and pick up items. Another one of these. Now we could probably kill the boss quite quick, in all fairness. But it does a lot of trample damage, so I'm going to move. <laughs> just let my... let them kill it. Oh look, I'm just killed the boss with my electric field, that's fine. That's fine. And then there's the rest with missiles. <laughs> Chance to tether yourself to an enemy. Now, this is a bit of a weird skill because I think the tether deals damage over time to them. Can't afford that at all. That crate up there. Whee! Jumps! See, for the starship you really need as much maneuverability as you can get. So jumps and run speed. I haven't had any run speed items as yet. This again? I suppose these are my run speed. <laughs> these will do. I wonder though about these random buffs or whatever, because I always thought it was just run speed. If any of you know that they give you anything other than run speed, then uh, do let me know. Yes. So now we just mop up. I survived! Holy moly! Well, it was a surprise to me, anyway. Are they just dropping skin cases behind? What the...? I didn't even have a chance to blink and it was killed by my... my henchies. Die already. What's this not... oh, that's not back from the gloves. Actually making things more... annoying. Well, I suppose it allows me to separate the monsters so that I don't have so much spike damage, perhaps. Hmm. Painful. See this tether, I'm not 100% on it, but I think it does a dot and it lets you know where they are, sort of thing. I don't think it affects your movement. What are you attacking? Oh. Oh my god. He hurts. Okay, now I'm quite scared. <laughs> Got him. Oh, level 16. Oh. Need some health. Come on, health. I'm like worried. Oh. See, I do get lifesteal, so... Really, the fastest way to heal is to just do this. Oh! Okay. Slash them up, slash them up. So I'll tell you what, I'm quite... 
quite optimistic. I didn't think I'd get this far. We might even do it this time. Oh, that'd be good. I thought it would take me a lot more tries, honestly. But I probably shouldn't celebrate just yet. the difficulty scales beyond like ha 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 because if so then next level I'm just gonna get one shot and I still I'm still pretty sure that we need more survivability for the next level we have almost nothing just for life steal we're relying on dealing heavy cluster damage we can still get spiked down one enemy sim sweet uh Cool. Let's go get the fat loots. Six grand's worth. The music's all intense even though everything's dead. No loots. That's madness. Madness. Hmm. Where's all the money? Is the, I mean the money is the crates. Oh. There's one. That's what we like. I can almost afford that golden one, but... Oh god. But I'm not sure I'll be able to get there. This is an awkward place. So. Just fear enemies when attack, that's cool. That'll help me survive in a very strange and abstract way. Didn't want you to have to watch me climb round again. Um. Oh, there's so much stuff to get though. Surely. Did we get all of this up here? Oh, sorry about that. I just had to disable Windows updates. It was really getting on my nerves. It would just, it would just pop up, and then, uh, and then I'd be like, close. <laughs> 